We got the Lakers. We got the Knicks. We got LeBron James playing. He was a game time decision with an illness. Lakers are going for the 30th win of the season. Last night, LeBron was cooking early. Six of 12 from downtown Richard Jefferson. It was his jumper. They were going underneath him like he was like this was like 03. I don't know what they were doing. That was a weird game plan to me. And then how about Alex Caruso with the headband? Oh, look at that. Look at that. That's a future head coach right there. All right, now we got that. <laughs> <laughs> now we got we got two scary moments for the Lakers. Boom, there's the first one. That's Contavious Caldwell Pulp getting clotheslined by Bobby Portis who would get thrown out. What do you think? It, it, it's to me, it's the windup. And look, Portis, I'm not even talking about his history. Anybody in the NBA, as long as you play basketball, the minute somebody he winds up like that, nothing good is going to come from him. So he would, again, he would get thrown out of the game with a flagrant two. KCP evaluating for a concussion. He would come back. And later in the game, LeBron, Lakers are up 17 points. That's a nice feed there to uh, Avery Bradley from LeBron. Now here comes the second one. And you're not going to need me to explain to you what happens as you see it. Third quarter, Lakers are leading. Anthony Davis playing defense. Mm. Oh, and down he goes. Anthony Coach Fisdale, right he came down right on the safe. Oh, man, that's that's the worst feeling in the world when you land on that tailbone. That is a painful injury, but hopefully it won't be out for too long. The, the, the read on it, again, as you said, is usually it hurts like crazy, but so long as the x-rays are negative, which they were, it usually isn't something that lasts that long. He would walk off onto his own power. Lakers would go on to win on easily. Every in the NBA, guys get injured. Um, guys get sick. And um, obviously, we know what, what 80 is meant for this team. Um, you know, and obviously, there's no replacing him. You can't say, let's, we're going to replace what he does. He does everything. So, you know, but everybody else just got to chip in and be better. And, um, so, but we'll see. We'll see what happens with, 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 his, um, with his injury and, um, you know, and then take it from there. So Anthony Davis was able to walk in the player tunnel again. These are some of the things that I have here. A source uh, told ESPN the plan is for him to undergo an MRI today. He is expected to miss the upcoming road trip in Dallas and OKC to stay back and rehab. Just as a coach, which you've been for so long, when you see your star player go up like that and come down like that, what thoughts go through your mind? Uh, all the worst thoughts in the world. And, uh, you know, hopefully it's not too long before he's back because they're really rolling and playing great basketball. But... Uh, like I said before, that is a painful injury. Even I in my younger days have landed on my tailbone, <laughs> and it is not fun. And really, it's it's the scary. It's scary at first yeah. because you have a, about a second and a half there where you don't know if your elbow is going to pop out, if you're going to your wrist, yes. your, and then your back takes the takes most of it. But even then, you don't know. Like when you're getting up, you could be having back spasms for the next six weeks. There's a lot of things that can go on. At the end of the day, he's fine. That's the most important thing. They need to rest. They're playing well, like Coach said, and so you just got to kind of ride this out. Th that is the belief that we have here, that, is that he's going to be fine. Again, yeah. he misses a couple of games on a road trip. That obviously isn't the end of the world because, to your point, and we can talk more about this as we go, Lakers are they're playing well. Man. They're play and LeBron is playing very well. They won their 30th game last night. Well, I think, too, what you're going to see right now is LeBron's about to crank it up. If AD's out, LeBron knows how important their seeding is right now for them to, to really have a good position in the playoffs. And knowing him, it's about to go to another level. Well, RJ, having played with him all those years, what, what do you expect his mindset to be when AD is out for however long he's out? Well, the game changes a little bit. And, and Bron is still a game manager. He is one of the best scorers slash game managers out there. So that just means that there's going to be more three-point shots, other guys. And this could be an opportunity for Kuzma to give rolls. That's the guy. Yeah, that's yes. the guy. Kuzma, this is your opportunity because they're going to play a faster game. There's going to be more three-point shots taken in a game. So that's where guys like this can use this as an opportunity like Kuzma. Uzma, Caldwell Pope, those guys can kind of get rolling. Again, it, it, it seems in the big picture as though this was good news because when you see him go down like that, you start immediately assuming the worst. It appears that the worst is not what took place. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.